But first, we want to start with that breaking news out of the Big Apple. Charlotte is one step closer to getting a major league soccer team. Thanks for joining us, everybody. I'm Tanya Mendes. And I'm Fred Shropshire. Today, MLS held its annual Board of Governors meeting in New York City, where they talked about the league's 30th franchise and which city to award it to. Charlotte and David Tepper's bid were recently moved up to the top of the list. The other two cities looking to get a team, Las Vegas and Phoenix. But there are a lot of things that Tepper has narrowed down and solidified in his bid that those other two cities don't have. NBC Charlotte Sports Director Nick Carboni is live for us in New York City. Nick, uh, this seems like an almost done deal, but there's just one more thing we're waiting for. What is that? Yeah, Fred, in order to finalize this, there is that one more thing. Commissioner Garber just stepped out of those league meetings just a few minutes ago, and he told us that it's not a done deal yet, and he there is no timeline that he could comment on right now. But the league, he says, is still somewhat concerned with some improvements that Bank of America Stadium needs to make be to become more soccer friendly. But lo and behold, David Tepper and the rest of his bidding group from the Panthers was here today spending a good deal of time with Garber and other league owners trying to convince them that that will happen. And what needs to happen is over the next few weeks, Charlotte City Council needs to approve about $100 million in improvements to Bank of America Stadium to host a full-time soccer team in Charlotte. City Council votes Monday the 9th and Monday the 16th. If that is approved, those improvements, the MLS will be swift to finalize this deal. You can tell they really, really want to. As for the rest of Tepper's bid, which includes the promise of a passionate fan base and big time corporate sponsorships, the MLS really likes all of that. When you hear the presentation from uh, the ownership group and you, my experience with meeting with city leaders and meeting with their corporate community and knowing that the Carolinas overall are, are supportive of the sport, we've just got great confidence that it'll be a great city. All right, so again, Garber saying that this is not finalized just yet. I asked him specifically if he was confident that city council would approve those improvements. He said not confident, but hopeful. So why did Charlotte's bid, by the way, stand out so much over Vegas and Phoenix? And when could we see a team on the field at Bank of America Stadium? We're digging into all of that, and we'll have some answers for you coming up at 6 o'clock. Live in Brooklyn, New York, Nick Carboni for NBC Charlotte. Yep. Questions we all want to know the answers to. Nick Carboni and the Big Apple. Thank you, Nick.